just as they, the Western soldiers, wage war in our lands, you know it's halal, permissible, uh, for you to do it here. Uh, so that's not an isolated incident, as you well know. There have been other incidents in other European countries. Now, Al-Qaeda justified 9-11 by pointing to the Palestinian struggle. Do you think that modern-day terrorist organizations are starting to use Afghanistan in the same way? Um, well, probably, yes, because I think what um, the, the extremist groups are propagating is that the West had, ca had come in, uh, they had promised to reconstruct the country, development, uh, etc. It hasn't happened. Uh, in fact, the West is now killing uh, Afghans, more Afghans. It's using bombing. It's using, you know, heavy firepower uh, to deal with a small bunch of insurgents. Um, uh, so, yes, I mean, Afghanistan has very much become an example of, if you like, uh, um, uh, of the, the perception, at least amongst the extremists, of a failure by the West, um, the excessive wrong policies, excessive use of firepower, a disregard for local culture, local, um, you know, human beings, uh, local people, um, etc. So it, it, it has become a kind of poster boy, if you like, for the terrorists. And my final question is that you've made some accurate predictions in the past. So can I take advantage of you being here and ask you how you see transnational terrorism developing over the coming years? I think it's going to grow enormously simply because we now have, um, uh, we, we're now seeing base areas for Al-Qaeda uh, develop in Pakistan, which was not the case before. Um, if you look at the last six months and the kind of, uh, the, the plots that have been stopped just in Europe, Germany, Spain, Britain, um, uh, Denmark, um, almost all of them are traced back to the tribal areas in Pakistan. Um, now, uh, and I think we're going to see a, a greater expansion of this. I mean, this was not the case two or three years ago. Um, and, and God forbid if, if, you know, so many plots have been foiled, but the one plot that, that gets away and, and is successful, uh, which may kill hundreds and hundreds of people, um, whether it's in Europe or the United States or somewhere else, um, it's most likely that that plot would also be traced back to Pakistan. And of course, then that is going to create an enormous international um, uh, uh, crisis because, um, you know, uh, Pakistan will then be very much lumped, uh, you know, at least parts of Pakistan will be lumped very much as part of the uh, terrorist arena. Mr. Hamid, thank you for talking to NATO Review. Thank you very much.